I'm sure yeah. you were involved somewhere along the line. That's right. Pretend you don't know. One piece of advice. Don't travel through France on your way back. Or it'll cost you dearly. Calm wow. down, my friends. Looks like they're having Let's fun calm there. calm down. Everyone seems to be a little unnecessarily heated. Don't forget where you are, please. What's going on here exactly? Sir Gregory called us together to introduce the last guest. But hardly had we arrived when he is set upon Mom? Monsieur Peru. Who and is it? Who is this charming character? Manuel Godoy, the Duke oh. of La Alcudia. He's the head of the Spanish government, Monsieur de Richer. He's the one who, in practice, controls Spain. How could you dare do such a thing? Dios mio, you are all out of your minds! Really, Duke Manuel? What made you kick up such a fuss? What? Have you not heard? Well, <laughs> let me inform you that yesterday morning at 10.22 a.m. precisely, in the uh -huh. middle of the Place de la Révolution in Paris, by decree of the National Convention, which Monsieur Peru works for, King Louis was guillotined. What? Oh, no. The King of France is dead, gentlemen. Our monarchies are in danger. Oh, no. I have said it before. How dare they? Oh, dear. Oh. That it actually happened? I don't know too much about history, I would tell you honest. Hmm. Friends, friends, let us calm down. Don't pretend to be surprised. Really, like if someone told you me that that happened, trial. I wouldn't have no idea. Is that pretty bad? Bastard. He was sentenced to death by 361 votes to 360. That's not really fair if that's the case. For one vote. Is that your democracy? What an obnoxious act. Until this, anything was possible. This political coup will have grave consequences. France is lost. Gentlemen, please, let us take a step back a moment. In the name of holiness, he was the highest representative of God in France, Emily. Let's calm things down. Gentlemen, Duchess, we're all among people of reputable company here. We should be able to manage the conflicts of our nations in a respectful and orderly manner. I fully agree with you, sir. But that's enough, sir. With whom do I have the pleasure of speaking? Louis Moras de Richer. Who, me? Are you related to Sarah de Richer? Sarah is his mother, Duke. Gentlemen, this news affects us all, but I must ask you to remain calm. It's not the first time history has taken us by surprise. Let's ensure that our respective countries are allowed to respond appropriately to this news. Oh, rest assured. The response will not fall short. I'm never going to get uh, used to that guy's well, fucking Grace, painted face. Here I was something. preparing to introduce you as is proper, and you've beaten me to it. I'm delighted that we are all together at last. Our meeting will therefore be able to kick off shortly. I have just a few more little preparations to take care of before you all find out the reason for your presence here. In the meantime, I shall leave you Stretch. to get to know one another. When you hear the bell, please proceed to the conclave room on my left, behind that door. I'll see you later. Okay. Bye, I guess. New uh, character. Could you All right. Spare a moment, please, sir. I'm glad you asked. I want to talk to you too. Of course. Oh no! I heard about Only your chance. Disappearance. We looked Shit. concerned. I don't know why, but I doubt it's from oh Cynthia God. alone. We can't fail this. Let's see what he wants from me. We can't fail. Any news of her? Have you found her? Maybe. Um. We found traces of her that would indicate she's still on the island. A person of belongings? Yes, but nothing of great interest. Scraps of food, some clothes. And... Uh, oh, wait. I Isn't see. she afraid well, of him? Wasn't so she hiding from him? I shan't keep you, Monsieur de Richet. All right, then. Thank you. I hope that your search will prove successful and bring Sarah back to us soon. I must go now. I'll see you later. That's not fair. That was nothing. I know we shouldn't mention anything. I totally forgot that. Oh my god. 
All right. Great. Fine. Obviously, she has something against Volner. I just completely forgot about that. And I'm an idiot. So, cool. Cool. Awesome. Love that. Love that for us. There's a pattern with five circles on this chest. Use the key. Why not? Some more I miscellaneous space, things. I'll retrieve it later. Ugh. These things are useless. Honestly, though. Maybe I should just use one of these things, shouldn't I? Why not? I should just use Mr. abilities. Nice I keep saying that, room. honestly. But we really should just use abilities whenever we can. Does expression go beyond the nightmare mean anything to you at all? Well, metaphorically, yes. It sums up the career of a soldier quite well. I doubt that is what you want to hear, though. Indeed. That's surely not what I'm looking for. Well, monsieur, if you are looking for a phrase book, Lord Mortimer must surely have one, given the number of books he has. You ought to check in the library of the tower. You never know. Yeah, that's a good place to be, right? Would you have any more information about the conference Lord Mortimer spoke of? Nothing at all. Mortimer is very committed to secrecy when it comes to his conferences. But given the presence of Monsieur Peru and ourselves, I think it must concern France to some extent. Otherwise, I doubt he would have invited three Frenchmen to his table, huh? What do you think of Duke Godoy? Well, I'd rather not express any opinion of him. Why is that? His reputation is enough for me. Oh. Tell me more. Meaning... This gentleman enjoys people talking about him for too many reasons. His undeserved titles, more than ten in just four years, and each one more prestigious than the one before. You don't think he deserves them? If I had seen him on the battlefield, <laughs> there might be some doubt. But that is not the case. The queen would rather not risk losing him, so she consoles him with awards and titles. So you don't have a very positive opinion? His coveting French Catalonia does not encourage me to have one. I um. understand your point of view. Gotcha. Well, I'll be leaving you now. Shall we meet up again later? Wait, monsieur. Any news of your mother? Unfortunately not, no. I hope to speak with her about my deal before I leave. Let me know if you find her. A plus tard, yeah, monsieur. I'm, sh I'm sure she'll show up eventually. Oh, God. I hate that we're just like... Seriously sucking at like these confrontations. The I know that wasn't princes. a confrontation, but earlier as I at recall, least. Dorkin was my favorite character. Okay, useless. That's not gonna help us at all. Thing over here. Okay, I guess we'll go in the next room. Oh. Mm. I don't know if I should just check, like, randomly anywhere. Probably don't need to sit. Um. What do you want, Louis? I don't know. I've already asked you, but I don't remember the answer. Oh my god, is that what, what did you say to me about going beyond the nightmare? Good heavens, you're losing your memory. Apparently. I haven't the least idea what it might mean. Oh, all right. Mm, that's Ugh. too bad. Oh my god. What else what can we do talk want, about? Louis? What do you think of our last guest? 
Well, I never thought I would get the chance to meet that Hispanic Casanova in the flesh. His reputation is well known. The gentleman collects lovers, including, would you believe it, the Queen of Spain. Oh. Whatever, let's just Spain use it. Why not? Indiscreetly say, the King, Godoy, and myself make up the Holy Trinity. The people have appropriately renamed them the Goat, the Ruffian, and the Whore. <laughs> I didn't see you being a mudslinger in your idle hours, I must say. <laughs> That's so funny. Um, Emily, what can you tell me about the coming conference? Sir Gregory and Lord Mortimer organize this kind of high society meeting every so often in order to consider the world situation. But to what purpose? Well, by bringing together the most influential people from the dominant nations of the modern world, they allow the mighty to discuss mm -hmm. matters with calm clarity. There are precedents of armistices being signed at the end of these talks, you know. Oh. Talking while holding a glass of brandy makes things easier. You'll see. I'm sure. All right, great. You're leaving me? Unfortunately, I have things to do. Thank you again, madam. Oh, my God. I don't know where to go. I'll be totally honest with you. Okay, let's just go look around, shall we? Just run around, see what we can find in here. That's not available to us. Hmm. Could they just tell me where exactly to go? Like what room? Thanks. <laughs> hey, I mean to do this. Going from room to room. Trying to find some more clues. I went room to room. Try to find more clues. Going room to room, trying to find more clues. Going room to room, trying to, trying to, trying to find my clues. Going room to room. Yay. Okay, clearly I am missing something. Can I go up here at all? Didn't Piaggi? Didn't they say something about Piaggi might know, might um, you know, knowing about the nightmare? What's but this? The Mortimer family. Oh, okay, great. That helps. What's this? Dante's Purgatory. Oh, Why great. does your mind presume to flight? When you're still like well, the Piaggi was up here, but is he up here now? No. Its final form. Was there Charming. like a part of the room in the room that we went downstairs that I'm missing? Although we haven't explored this room without Mortimer, right? Hmm. Let me just see that if I Ryan's forgotten the dates of the painting that's have like a quick exposition. Oh, see, this must be the guy that <laughs> is giving us all these paintings. Um, I guess you must remember to subject 4,000 years if you don't want the public to be surprised at the dating of the works. No need to remind you that Freemason year AL begins in March, not January. I'll about the long in this painting. I took the liberty to have the spear touched up so it better corresponds to the actual spear. Oh. I cannot urge you to strongly enough to do the same for yours. Yours sincerely. Okay, great. It's a good letter. Wow, that's a lot of money for candles. And for wine. Three hundred sixty thousand four hundred thirty-six pounds. Remember to reduce 
wood consumption. <laughs> That's really funny. I guess candles would have to be like a lot, I guess. I'm like, wow, they spent a lot of money on candles. And I'm like, oh, wait, it's... That's their only way to see things. Okay, so that makes sense. What is that? Let's take a closer look. What is that? What is that? It's just it's just chocolate. Now we shouldn't take what he might know. It's what's gone. It's a bad idea. Um. No, red berries. Do they need to take up a berry? I don't think they need that. I've seen this painting. A painting about a siege dated. Um, maybe I mean... A minor bird. Speak to the bird. Well, Waldo, is your master good? <laughs> Sarah Deriche? Waldo, you know Sarah? Okay, wait, I want to see if I can feed the bird. <laughs> All right, let's, okay, let's actually take one. I want to see what happens. Not that I think that, the, I don't think the bird is going to give us any secrets, but, you know. Hmm. Might come in handy. <laughs> Worth the try. A minor bird. <laughs> Oh no, what if I killed the bird or something? Well, That'd Waldo, is your master good? Okay, I guess I just wanted to see if it would do anything after that. I don't that. really know what I was expecting. Never mind. Let's keep bird. All right. Did you find out everything we could over here? All right. Oh, it's all four oh. here. Ah, oh, sweet. People just dropping money left and right. Could not pick that item up. All right, let's find Piaggi. I almost forgot that he might know a little something about where to go. But I don't remember which room was his. Are we going here? No. Thank God we can run in this game, otherwise it would be just really painful to get around. Hmm. Also just downstairs, and I'm wasting time. Because that's very possible, isn't it? I think everyone, I don't think anyone's going to be in their room. But I am thinking about it. We can't go in our own room, so I don't know. Kind of doubting it'll let us go anywhere. Duke Manuel Godoy. Okay. So that's his room. Yeah, I think the only way we can go, I guess, is back downstairs. Hello, Washington. Go beyond the nightmare. Does this line remind you of anything in particular? You caught me unaware here, Louis. Of course, I expect Let you to actually think about know. it a second. No, nothing <laughs> comes to mind. Sorry, Good. Louis, but I am unable to help you. Love that. Mr. President, what do you think about your counterpart, Duke Manuel? I'm very surprised he was able to accept Lord Mortimer's invitation, given the political situation in Spain. Let's use one of these. What do you mean? The situation is ready to explode with France over Catalonia. Well, the Duke must have a darn good reason to be absent and come here, mustn't he? 
When Lord Mortimer invites you, Louis, you come. It's always in your best interest. I wouldn't say that personally, but... <laughs> Mr. President, can you tell me a little more about the coming conference? Of course, Louis. That's why we're here. Lord Mortimer or Sir Gregory regularly organize meetings like this to put forward major projects. What do you mean by major projects? I'd prefer to let Lord Mortimer explain that to you, Louis. Let's oh. say he brings together influential people in order okay. to consider possible actions to undertake to guarantee the future of nations. Do you know the theme of the conference? Not in the slightest. None of the guests know the theme before arriving. But you'll see. Everything will turn out fine. Sure. Don't worry. Well, thank you for your time. Don't mention it, my young friend. Regarding your question oh. on the nightmare, don't hesitate to question the others about it. Maybe one of them knows more than I do. That's a good idea. Great. Thank you once again. I'll see you in a little bit. Let me know somewhere there. Anyone in here? No. In here? Well, that's where Napoleon was. Didn't really find out much about him, did we? I guess the only way is over there. Right. It's fine. I feel like there's so many people I need to talk to, but I can't find any of them. Ugh. In here, maybe? Come on. Something. Seems like a big room. I, mean, I know I've been in here before, but I literally just always forget more. Ah, Louis. All this is. Just the man. Good lord. I hope it was just How butterflies just come to all over the place. I would I think, think butterflies have to live in like really warm intervened. climate, right? So can they just like find like, you know. Anyway. It just keep using our caramelite water because Your Eminence, I haven't been following the case. I'm sure that the order did everything in its power. Unfortunately, you know the situation in Paris and well it's chaotic at best. Anything can happen in those revolutionary tribunals. The king is the official representative of God yeah. on earth, my son. Your Eminence. France has become a secular state. The king was just another citizen to them. He refused to admit his errors, looked down upon them, and attempted to escape. What did he expect? Oh. France has lost all reason, Louis. I invite you to speak about it with my mother as soon as she reappears. Uh, is there any news of her? I... Well, I hope it won't be long before I find her, Your Eminence. Now you wanted to speak to me. Yes. Nightmare! Did the nightmare to you, does it make you think of anything? Hmm. Your question is strange, my son. Sure is. Difficult to say. Could you at least tell me a little more about the context? Well, I mean, if it were a place or an object found on this island, what would you think of first? Hmm. The nightmare. No. <laughs> I don't see anything. I'm sorry. No, well, that's too bad. Ah, wait. Ah. I suppose it might be that horrible painting hanging in Lord Mortimer's study. Pretend oh. not to be that interested. Right. Well, don't worry about it. I was, I was just curious. Okay. Uh, let's ask what I've been asking everybody else. I'm sure a man like you is in the circle of trust. 
Would you know what the conference that Lord Mortimer mentioned is going to be about? Not really, my son. Well, be it Lord Mortimer or Sir Gregory, uh, we are never informed about the theme of the conference before it begins. Okay. I was wondering what to think of that Manuel Godoy. He is reputed to be a very ambitious character at every level. But his fate is unwavering. He is a staunch defender of the church. Oh, God. Believe me. Love that. Thank you for everything, Your Eminence. I shan't take up yeah, any more of your time. Yeah, super helpful. You are welcome, my son. Thanks. I will be seeing you, Rui. Okay, whatever. Can you give us a clue about the painting, I guess? Oh, so that was the clue that we needed? Oh. Okay, sweet. Just... Wow, look how bright it is. Ooh. This, like, brightness just lit up, lit up, like, my whole face, apparently. It's super dark everywhere else in this mansion. So. Alright, into the darkness we go. <laughs> Alright. Let's see. Was in here? Can't touch it, so why does it matter, I guess? Alright. I forgot this is over here. Was there anything of use in here? I really Mattress, shouldn't even. I mean, I place. already looked through all Clear over here. I don't think there's gonna be anything. I think we're just gonna go to Mortimer study since that's what it says. Yeah. Okay. And we're running. Running, 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 running through this room.